Dokert Channing's life and photography career. One of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email, send text message, Stalker Channing's life and photo Stalker Channing credit. Nancy R. Schiff slash Getty, John Lamparski slash Getty born on February 13, 1994. Stalker Channing's acting career has spanned five decades in Hollywood and beyond. Best known for her turns as Rizzo in Greece and Dr. Abby Bartlett on The West Wing, the 13-time Emmy nominee has had a storied career. In honor of her 78th birthday, we're looking back at some of her most iconic roles. 1 of 16 view all advertisement advertisement 2 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message. Stalker Channing in The Girl Most Likely To The Girl Most Likely To Credit Getty Channing starred as Miriam, a homely, brilliant girl who is bullied in college for her looks, in this 1973 TV movie that put her on the map. After an accident causes her to undergo plastic surgery, she emerges jaw-droppingly beautiful, and proceeds to take her revenge on the people who had previously made her suffer. 2 of 16 view all 3 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email, send text message, stalkered Channing as Rizzo. In Greece Greece credit, CBS slash Getty 5 years later, Channing skyrocketed to stardom as Rizzo the edgy and jaded leader of the Pink Ladies in Greece, starring alongside Olivia Newton-John and John Travolta in the movie musical. The actress famously showed off her pipes with the emotional ballad, There Are Worse Things I Could Do. 3 of 16 view all advertisement continued on next slide. Advertisement 4 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message Stalker Channing in Heartburn Fortune Credit. Giddy Channing played Julie in 1980's AXS Heartburn, a friend of a food writer and a womanizing D.C columnist going through an acrimonious divorce, based on the Nora Ephron novel. All we have, especially as film actors, is the process of the day, you work on the scene and do the scene. And so it's really important and satisfying to work with people of such caliber. Channing told the New York Times of working alongside Streep and Nicholson. 4 of 16 view all advertisement, 5 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email, send text message Stockard Channings. Love life Stockard Channing and David Debin credit. Ron Galella slash Ron Galella Collection slash Getty the actress has been married four times to Walter Channing Jr. From 1964 to 1967, Paul Schmidt from 1969 to 1976, David Debin from 1976 to 1980, and David Rall from 1982 to 1988. Speaking about her relationships to The Guardian in 2006, she explained, what have I learned from my divorces? I know that nobody gets married to get divorced. I don't think he'll get married another time. 5 of 16 view all 6 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message Stockard Channings. First big award Stockard Channing credit. CBS slash Getty the actress received the 1979 People's Choice Award for Best Supporting Actress for her beloved turn. As Rizzo in Mega Hit Greek, Channing has been nominated for and won numerous awards for her work through the years, with two Emmys, two Screen Actors Guild Awards, a Tony and more to her name. 6 of 16 view all advertisement advertisement continued on next slide. Advertisement 7 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message Stalker Channing sitcom Stalker Channing credit. CBS slash Getty here, Channing posed for a promotional shot for her eponymous sitcom, The Stockard Channing Show, which ran for one season in 1980 and saw the actress portraying a divorcee named Susan Goodino. 7 of 16 view all advertisement advertisement 8 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message. Stockard Channing at the Met Gala Stockard Channing David Rawl credit. Ron Galella slash Ron Galella collection slash Getty here. Channing dressed to the nines with her fourth husband, businessman David Rawl, for the 14th annual Met Gala, themed, Costumes of India, in New York City in 1985. 8 of 16 view all advertisement, 9 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email, send text message. Stalker Channing's Oscar nomination, 6 degrees of separation, 6 degrees of separation credit. Movie store slash Shutterstock Channing was nominated. For Best Actress at the 1994 Academy Awards for her memorable role in Six Degrees of Separation, Will Smith, who starred alongside her in the film, has spoken out about how he fell in love with Channing while filming due to method acting. With Six Degrees of Separation, I got a taste early of the dangers of going too far for a character. He told The Esquire in 2015, My character was in love with Stockard Channing's character, and I actually fell in love with Stockard Channing. Well, I'm very flattered, Channing responded to page 6. That's a wonderful thing. I adored him from the first time I laid eyes on him, because I thought he was genuinely sweet. I felt very protective of him, because it was his first big job. It's amazing for me to hear that he felt that way, I'm delighted. 9 of 16 view all advertisement advertisement continued on next slide. Advertisement 10 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message Stockard Stockard Channing's Lasting Love Stockard Channing and Daniel Gillum credit, Ron Galella slash Ron Galella Collection slash Getty after her four marriages. Channing met cinematographer Daniel Gillum, whom she has been dating since the early 90s. Speaking to The Guardian in 2006, 
Channing revealed she didn't see herself ever marrying again. I've been living with my partner for over 20 years, so it would feel quite silly, actually. Here, she's pictured with her longtime love in 1993, at the premiere party for her film Six Degrees of Separation at Tavern on the Green in N.Y.C. 10 of 16 view all advertisement 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 11 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email. Send text message stalker Channing's many roles married to it credit. Orion slash Getty with 97 acting credits to her name, it's hard to pick Channing's most notable role. Here, she's seen toasting co-stars Mary Stuart Masterson and Cybill Shepard in a scene from 1991's Married to It. 11 of 16 view all advertisement advertisement 12 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message. Stockard Channing's movies in the 2000s Julia Stiles and Stockard Channing credit. Bill Davila slash Film Magic the actress starred alongside Julia Stiles in 2001's drama The Business of Strangers for which she won a London Film Critics Circle Award for Actress of the Year. 12 of 16 view all advertisement advertisement continued on next slide. Advertisement 13 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message. Stockard Channing on the West Wing the West Wing credit. Michael O'Neill BCU Photo Bank BC Universal slash Getty besides her role in Greece. Channing is best known for her seven-year turn as Dr. Abby Bartlett in the West Wing from 1999 to 2006. As first lady to President Jed Barlett, Channing was Emmy nominated for Best Supporting Actress six times. She took home the award in 2002, that same year. She also won the Emmy for Best Supporting Actress in a miniseries or movie for her turn in NBC's The Matthew Shepard Story. 13 of 16 view all advertisement 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 14 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email. Send text message Stockard Channing at the 2000 Emmy Stockard Channing credit. Lucy Nicholson slash AFP. Getty celebrating the first of her six nominations for Best Supporting Actress in a drama series for her role in The West Wing. Channing was a vision in red at 2000 Primetime Emmy Awards in Los Angeles. 14 of 16 view all advertisement advertisement 15 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message. Stockard Channing on The Good Wife Stockard Channing, The Good Wife credit. Paul Sarkis slash CBS via Getty Channing's most recent recurring TV role was as Veronica Loy on The Good Wife in which she played the protagonist's mom over the course of 13 episodes from 2012 until 2016. 15 of 16 view all advertisement advertisement continued on next slide. Advertisement 16 of 16 FB tweet more Pinterest email send text message Stockard Channing in theater. Apologia, Broadway photo call credit. Bruce Glicas slash Film Magic the Tony-winning actress reprised her starring role as Kristen Miller a 1960s political activist who is facing repercussions of her past, in the Alexi K. Campbell play Apologia. After a successful run in London, the play debuted at the Roundabout Theatre Company in September 2018. Here, Channing is pictured with Hugh Dancy, who played the double role of her two sons. 16 of 16 view all advertisement 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 replay gallery. Share the gallery Pinterest Facebook up next cancel.